Welcome to the video. In today's video, I'm gonna go over two different cryptocurrencies that had been that has been requested over the last 24 hours. And as always, if you have a cryptocurrency or a stock that you won't analyze, drop it in the comment section and we'll take a look at it live on video to help you get a, be a better understanding of which way the market may move and how it may affect the price of your particular asset. So this one was um, requested by Andre. Andre, I appreciate you for bringing this up because this has been a money maker. Um, as you can see, on um, mock you have this beautiful fallen wedge which is um, identified right here by the blue trend lines that you see on your screen you can see the bullish price consolidation and we've gotten a break out of this fallen wedge which has been gorgeous um since the breakout has happened as you can see the measured move on this fallen wedge is 132 percent so you're looking at over 1x return and it's looking really good today because it's finally gotten above a level of resistance that has been struggling at in the past you can see right here it was rejected once price tried to break that level in the past and you can see here two candle closes right here below that level and as you can see right back here in march once you broke this highlighted blue horizontal level you can see mog continue to decrease but since the rejection Mog has now gotten above that level and it looks as if it can complete the measure move and you will be looking at over a 1x on your investment. So good job on Mog and Andre. I appreciate you for bringing that to my attention because I would have missed the whole thing. I didn't even know what Mog was until you um, brought it up to me. And you can see here, let's um, take a look on the big screen. This is what um, I've been doing with Mog. Um, I bought my Mog um wrap to the ethereum pair because i'm more interested in holding ethereum long term than i am mog so as the price of mog goes up i'm earning more ethereum when i sell this off so i'm interested in owning eth for a very long time and we got some exciting news on eth this week that the etf approval may be happening so i want to hold all the ethereum that i can so i just use mog and i um bought it using the ethereum pair um, I spent 1.5 Ethereum in this, right? And now you can see that was up, that 1.5 ETH was worth $463 at the time. And you can see we're up now. So if I was to sell this right now, I would have more ETH and not USD because I want to hold me a big bag of ETH for a long time. So I use Mog to do that to increase my ETH holding. So good job on Mog. As you can see, we're up big time on this nothing but green screens and that's what i like let's take a look at the next one let's take a look at the very next one the next one that i have on deck is caspa and again andre i appreciate you for bringing caspa up to my attention because i was not looking at this asset at all and it is not on my it wasn't on my radar or my watch list but i have gotten some casper now because when you brought this up yesterday it, the chart almost looks looks similar to mob you have another bullish consolidation structure falling wedge here as you can see on the screen and you are just now breaking out of this falling wedge so there's more upside here on casper as you can see your first resistance level is up here at 15 cents and i believe you are right now you are still currently about 10 to 12% away from that first resistance level. So yeah, you're about 10% away from the first resistance level up here at 14 cents. You're currently trading at 13 cents. I mean, this thing looks gorgeous. You are, you're above the 200 moving average. If you take a look at the, um, the momentum oscillators, you can see you got triple bullish divergence. Right, and that's marked by the consecutive lower lows on price. And then you have the higher lows here on momentum, letting you know that sellers are getting exhausted. So that's a great thing to see. And you also have it on the, um, you also have it on your RSI, on your relative strength indicator. As you can see, just higher levels of relative strength when it relates to Casper. Everything looks extremely bullish on this. You are in the bullish territory on your RSI. Man, good look on Caspa, and we have some, now we do. We just bought it yesterday, and you can see your first level of resistance again is up here at 14 cents, but above this, 
this thing can really get going really fast just like on mog i bring mog back up you see mog is breaking its on resistance level if you take a look at cas caspa is lagging behind but with more upside potential right now since the broke since the breakout just occurred yesterday when i trade i like to look for confirmations i like to look at breakouts i like to look at back test you know i like to look at double bottoms i like to look at confirmation and cas has broken out so we shall see if this thing continues to run up and if you would like to look at what we're doing with caspa see if i can find this in my portfolio real quick Here we go, Caspa. Let's pull this up right here. On the big screen, you can see right here, we made our purchase on Cas just yesterday. Just yesterday on May 20th. You know, we bought 6,500 and 4,000, two separate orders. So now we have over 10,000 Cas, and you can see what we spent on it. You can see what we spent on and now we're up just $37 with a 2.79% change. We're still early in this trade setup, but man, if you take a look at the technicals, you can see why I bought this asset. Look, the beautiful falling wedge breakout above the 200 moving average with seller exhaustion, meaning that buyers could be taking control. Yeah, man. I had to bag me some so thank you andre and again if you're watching my videos and you have a stock or a cryptocurrency that you'll like analyze just drop it in the comment section and we'll take a look at it live on video good assets andre i appreciate you and let's see if we continue to make money on these two peace i'm out and as always remember to like share subscribe and comment drop that stock or crypto in the comment section if you want to analyze so you will know what could happen with price potentially peace and thanks for watching the video